Hello and welcome back to Dial H for Hero Clicks. Guys, we have an awesome video for you today. Thanks to WizKids, they sent us a brick of Black Panther to spoil for everybody. And like always, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to Dial H for Hero Clicks because we're going to be giving away this entire brick what? to one. The entire thing? The entire thing. Everything. I guess we're giving away the entire thing. The entire thing. We don't even know what's in it. I know. And that's the best part. So now, okay. You get a... <laughs> come on. I come mean, on. For you guys, anything. Perfect. So <laughs> we'll give away the entire break to one lucky commentator. Uh, commenter. Although, just so you know, because it is a lot, we're going to do US only on this one. US. Guys. So you sorry. Uh, but thank you, you so much to all the international people that support us, of course. But just because it is going to be so much to ship, this is going to be US only. But still comment on the video for what you're excited about, uh, what you hope to see us pull, or what you're happy that we got to pull. Ian, do you want to kick us off with the uh, little topping here? Ooh, I do. Okay. We got to see some cool ones. I've got a few featured right here. You do. Really curious to see what they're going to do with Odin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This guy's got some monster values, but he is phasing top dial, so might have to work their Thanos magic to make oh, him work. <laughs> why even? Oh, no, no, no dude. No. That would be, that'd be kind of wild. It would be. Probably not a good wild either. Probably not a good wild. You know. What do cool. we got? We've got Cersei oh, cool. from, actually, what is set that is she from? The Mighty Thor? Oh, Avengers Assemble, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Avengers Assemble. That's Avengers cool, Assemble. Cool. All right, well, she's coming in at 80 or 50 points. She's got Fighting the Scroll Pantheon as a trait. Also, Avengers, Power Cosmic, some Eternals keyword. Ooh. God Squad. God Squad. You heard of that? Not in a while. <laughs> no. I think it's like Hercules that's, gets it sometimes. That's an old that's one, like, yeah. That's an old one, okay. yeah. So, it's when Cersei attacks... Opposing characters can't use shape change, and opposing characters with a deity keyword can't evade attacks. Nice. Whoa, okay. I like this. I, I like dig this. that. Training since the dawn of time is her attack special, which you see down the dial, which is Blades, Claws, Fangs, Close Combat Expert, and Range Combat Expert. So a nice bump to her values. Dang. You usually see that with the legacy Helps pieces. Out, yeah. And then a damage special. She has this on her top dial, not on the bottom dial. Again, down dial. Molecular Rearrangement and Transmutation. Probability control and shape change yourself. Free. Replace up to three non-debris terrain markers within range and line of fire with any combination of blocking, smoke, or water terrain markers. What's her, okay. What's her point value? 80. 80, okay. Yeah, I, I like, know. Ball show, man. Is yeah. that you? <laughs> yeah. I was okay, definitely cool. getting hints of that. Okay. You know, some mind control, some TK. Yeah, some shape change, some nice support there. Probability control is never bad. Flight. No, this isn't bad at all. This is, I think, a good addition to... The God Squad. Yeah, the God Squad. <laughs> but even on a lower dial, too. Fill out that keyword. <laughs> yeah. Some running shot, okay, cool. psychic blast, perplex. Yeah. I think she's a pretty well-known Avenger. I would say the legacy. She's pretty classic. She jumps in from Avenger stories here and there. But let's mm -hmm. crack into Let's crack into this first pack, ladies and gents. Ooh. Baby. Love it. Oh, my God. Okay. We have... Oh! Yo. Oh! Starting hot... Starting just a little hot, a super rare prime okay. right off the bat. So we have Ao, Scientist Supreme, Hercules, Amadeus Cho, and Kirby. And then our new figure is White Tiger Prime, which is this really sick effect of like this green translucent like tiger head. Behind yeah, it. that's really cool. really cool. We've kind of seen that now with like the Ultra Chase Superman, like that clear plastic. Yeah. Okay. Well, we saw What's the non prime with Scott. So let's see. So she's only 40 points. She has AIM, Avengers, Heroes for Hire, Animal Deity, Herald, Martial Artist, Mystical, Avengers Team Ability, of course. Manifest the Chi Tiger is her first trait. At the beginning of your turn, you may either generate a Chi Bystander, max one, or remove a friendly Chi Bystander from the game. Oh, interesting. Okay. A little Bystander kind of reset there. Not quite as crazy as like Camo's like Bystander reset. That's kind of neat. Giving the Tiger God control. If the Chi Tiger Bystander is not on your force... White Tiger takes a maximum of two damage from attacks and modify her attack value plus one. That's really cool. So now she would be like a 13 for four when she's attacking with her close combat expert. She's charged close combat expert. That's really cool. And Avengers points. TA too. So oh yeah, it's be a 14, 14. 14 attack. Ooh. Just maxing out the stats. I like the improved movement, hindering, or sorry, excuse me, elevated and characters. And then the Chi Tiger bystander is no slouch. Oh. <laughs> Five speed sidestep, 12 attack blades, 18 invulnerability, and four damage. And it's giant? And it's giant. Wow. That is kind of gnarly, actually. 40 Holy points? smokes. Oh yeah. My goodness. I think that's kind of where her prime, I guess, comes in is making an insane bystander. Yeah, and it's, it's beginning Dude. of the turn that it generates, yeah? It is. 
At the beginning okay. of your turn, you either generate one. Okay, or so no drop one. shipping. Yeah, no drop <laughs> shipping. No, just dropping it in there. Okay, cool. Okay. Dang, that is a gnarly super prime. It's a really gnarly start to the brick too. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Dude. Okay, I dig this. Lots of keywords to work with too. Animal is already very formidable. Maybe this is the prime you're adding to your squad. Mystical, obviously no slouch. That <laughs> took worlds this year, and it's surprisingly still very good. Yeah, this is sick. This is really cool. I, I love this thing. I love the transparent. <laughs> this it, is man. so cool. Yeah. Okay, nice. All right. Well, White Tiger. I can't imagine I'm going to be able to follow up. I don't know, super dude. Well, but the booster battle's tough. Booster battle, this, yeah. This one zero around. for sure. Well, maybe I've spoken too soon. I don't know. You never know. Yeah, I think you got me. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, I think we've seen the entirety of this booster. I know we've seen him already, but that's too bad. We're going to talk a little bit about him. Because I love the design of this figure so much. We're seeing the return of Secret Identity, which is a ton of fun. And then, ah, man, this is just miles to a T, I feel like. 75 or 40, I think both of these lines are fantastic, depending on what you're going for. The stealth and opposing line of fire can't be drawn to Spider-Man if he is occupying or adjacent to a non-debris terrain marker. Mm. So he says no to Mern. That's good. He yeah, says yeah, no, yeah. no, Mern. Precision strike with a 12 attack, triple targets. And when Spider-Man hits, after resolutions, give each hit character an action token. Beautiful. Yeah. Spidey senses tingling, some combat reflexes, super senses. And yeah, really, like having the option of being that hyper-offensive, hypersonic piece without wit. Or if you're just looking for a low-point bruiser, fantastic. And then the miles that we already saw in the set as well, being able to secret identity and yeah, yeah, yeah. secret identity into him. This is just a fantastic piece. I'm really excited about this one. Definitely one I hope to see some play in pulp and one I'll be putting on a board. Regardless, and probably playing against Luke, playing against it way too much. <laughs> I think. We've seen everything in this pack. We do get a little Vibranium card, though, which is nice. Ooh. I always like to get that. I like the art on it. Yeah. It's pretty fun. Vibranium token. Ooh, ah. <laughs> I do want to chat, I guess, a little bit about White Wolf, just because I think he's really cool. Yeah, that, I think we've seen everything in there. We've seen everything, mm -hmm. yeah. But White Wolf is pretty neat. I feel like he's really just kind of based off the Captain America, like, Cold War storyline that came out last year, where he actually, like, turns into a like literal like werewolf wolf man i feel like that's kind of what they're getting at with this like battle theory these like high damage like blades and everything so oh, low damage actually <laughs> but a lot of blades charge where he goes from this like running shot piece this very animalistic piece i just think it's cool he's also like got the monster keyword which is really neat but yeah i just think white wolf's kind of neat he's very simple 40 points but yeah seven clicks too. 40 points seven clicks a stop click I don't know. I feel like he's got some cool, like, pulp viability as well, just being really solid. Legs to stand on. You know, on. of course, Copy stealth the, stealth. the entire time. Yeah. yeah, he's got the whole kind of team ability. I like it a lot, especially, like, the stop on the damage versus the defense is oh, always sure. nice. Yeah. You're not getting through you know? anything, Captain Exa America. Exactly. Exactly. So, I don't know. I think this piece is really cool, but let's jump into the next pack here. Sure. Yeah, we won't keep you guys waiting. <laughs> or will we? Hmm. To be continued. Maybe we will. <laughs> Ooh, okay, well, I think this is one Calder's going to want to talk about, so you guys might have already seen oh, it on camera. Oh, yeah, yeah, that so. is sick. This is a new one, too. A Koye, an uncommon. So really filling out the kind of Black Panther squad around him. No surprise, yeah, the Black Panther set. But it is cool, man. Uh, the paint jobs, again, with all the gold. And, like, oh, the man, that is that really good looking, set. actually. It oh, really gosh. pops. And even, like, the pattern on, like, the waist. Yeah. Uh, Tassel, Tassel thing, yeah. Okay. yeah. I was going to say Tass, I was like, I'm not sure if that's right. But yeah, let's check her out. Let's see, Okoye coming in at 60 or 30. Ooh, these split lines are, again, super solid. Wakanda, martial artist, spy, warrior. So martial artist seemingly getting some legs to stand on in this set. Director of the Agents of Wakanda is her trait. When establishing theme teams, characters with the spy keyword gain the Wakanda keyword. Okay, spy master, hello? <laughs> Jeez, yeah. <laughs> Vibranium Spear is her attack ability, which is Blades, Claws, Fangs, and Precision Strike. Free. Remove up to any three Vibranium tokens on your sideline from the game. If you do, Okoye can use Giant Reach X this turn, where X is twice the number of Vibranium tokens removed. Mm. Big Spear. Okay, so six range Giant Reach. That's kind of fun. <laughs> I dig that. 
Damage special as well, leadership, okay, that's really solid. When Akoya uses leadership and succeeds, you may instead generate a 0-12 Dora Milaje on its red starting line. If a 6 was rolled, you may also add two Vibranium tokens to your sideline. Dang. Okay, so I think if we've learned anything from Scott's unboxing and this one so far, the Vibranium generation is incredible, and the commons that's and uncommons... Man, that's just crazy cool. That's really good, oh. isn't it? 30 points for some yeah, charge super I like that senses? a lot. Oh my goodness. Yeah, this is a this is a really solid piece. 30 point leadership. I really like that. I really like that lower line. Yeah, Cheap it's such leadership a budget, is a, such a budget a line, right? Man. Or you know, if you want to go 60, they have the stealth combat reflexes, like the perfect combo, right? Oh my oh, god. Match made in heaven. Yeah, I like this. This is a crazy crazy solid uncommon. So, yeah. Again, just props to having multiple playable lines. That's that's fantastic. This is crazy cool. Uh, gotta <laughs> talk about my boy, one of my boys, but we got Namor. So obviously a big Captain America fan and Namor is an ally, sometimes villain. And it looks like from this storyline, I wanna say, I think he's more ally here. He's looking pretty ally. I think he's kinda got like a normal crown. He's got his little, uh, little royal scepter type mm. deal going on here. So he has Atlantis, Avengers, Cabal, Defenders, Illuminati, Invaders, and Rulers. So maybe, yeah, Defenders is kind of what they use as like a Invaders team ability. Mm -hmm. So I feel like that'll be kind of more like an Invaders Namor, this guy. So he has Atlantis attacks as his trait. When Namor starts the game, generate a water train marker in any square. When an adjacent friendly character with Dolphin makes a close attack, modify their attack value plus one if the target is adjacent to Namor. That's great. So yeah, just... Again, blanket helping out all dolphins if Namor's kind of like kinda Duke leading Thomas. the charge. A little bit, yeah, mm -hmm. pretty much like Luke Thomas. He has, uh, I guess we'll do his special damage first before his defense, because it shows up before on dial. Leadership, when Namor uses it and succeeds, he may instead remove an action token from a friendly character with dolphin. Bada bing, bada boom. Yeah, I mean instead, yeah, so you just do it anywhere versus adjacency, whatever, anybody, higher points, whatever. It's pretty cool. And then his last two clicks are aquatic healing, willpower, regeneration as free, but only if Namor occupies water mm. terrain. Something he we've has seen for sure. Some cool special improved movement to kind of mimic his flight, but of course he himself has the dolphin symbol. I do like it when they just give him dolphin and then improve movement for his kind of like little ankle wings, you know? Yeah. Isn't that right, Namor? Uh, so he's got like elevated outdoor blocking and he can move by characters. So this is actually is just flight, actually. Straight up he has he has just the exact <laughs> okay. improved movement of flight. Well, so he's go. either 65 or this great 40 point line. They're loving these split lines where he's gonna be a 12 for four with charge super strength at 40 Again, points. With Avengers. Or more of like a sitting back kind of leader with just some sidestep, a heavier reducer with invincible and like that leadership or he's just this really forward attacker, which I really enjoy. So yeah, this is crazy cool. I love seeing a good Namor, uh, his special appearance, Avengers number eight from 2020. Don't know exactly what that storyline was, but this definitely feels like a classic, like Invaders Namor, which I really enjoy. That's sweet. And this sculpt is awesome. Oh my gosh. The water dude. effect's fantastic The on white caps on the water, mm -hmm. that's really crazy cool. Yeah, I dig this. I dig this a lot. This is sick. Oh, I oh no, wait, this is, my, this is my, this is my, oh yeah, yeah, that's right. It's my pack to open. Yeah, I, it I just, is. Oh my goodness gracious. Amateur hour. Uh, get in the comments. It is late. Let them know. <laughs> it is late. But when there's a boot, when there's a brick at the house, you don't you don't wait, folks. You get mm. off work and you get right to it. Okay, I think this is also a pack where we've seen everything. This is Storm, Miles Morales, Aim Agent, Achille, and then mm. Venom. But we have, is this like the physical vibranium, right? Yeah, yeah we had seen pretty Scott sweet. talk about that a bit. We saw that really in like uh, fan appreciation as well. We did, yeah. And then it also has a vibranium token <laughs> with it. I like how shiny it is. Yeah, dang, I gotta take a look myself. No, that's really cool. And then yeah, with the special little vibranium effect as well. Yeah, that's crazy cool. I like this a lot. I like that we get both, both a vibranium token and the vibranium effect card. That's actually really sweet. Mm -hmm. hmm. There you go, folks. Right on. Cool. Sorry, nothing new in that I one. I also just want to shout out, I do really like Venom. I think he's really cool. Uh, the more like, he's not necessarily Serpent Society, but he's a cool like snake. It's like the mask, snake but with snakes. Villain. <laughs> it's like the it's mask. It's like the mask, but with snakes. <laughs> but with snakes, okay, <laughs> sure. Basically. But yeah, it's pretty fun. I looked into his history and the Wikipedia page said the mask. Said the mask, but with snakes. Parentheses, <laughs> but with snakes. Ooh, ooh. We already saw this guy, but I just, I mean, we talked about it ad nauseum at this point. I'm a sucker. He's a sucker for colored bases. Oh, Ooh. whoa. Hold on a second. 
What do you think? <laughs> oh, this is cool. Okay, okay. All right. What do we got in here? Well, we have a deity base, mm. which is usually a good sign. Oh, baby. Okay. And we'll get this on full display in just a second here. Uh, rest of the pack to do. We have seen the base I was initially talking about was Hercules. But there ended up being another colored base in here. Ooh. And this is one that we saw the render for very early on in the set. And it looks like she is not going to disappoint. There is quite a bit of text on this one. But we have our chase. And this is pretty exciting. It's pretty cool, actually. Like I really like seeing it in real life. Any character on a big throne is always really fun. I know there's going to be a lot of fan favorites out there. And this is definitely one of them. Oh, yeah. Okay, Ooh. six range triple bolts right off the bat. We have Loki, guys. Let's take a closer look. Minions of Doom TA, Mystic TA, Asgardian, Cabal, Illuminati, Deity, Mystical, and Warrior. Warrior, another keyword to no surprise, coming up a ton in the set. Yeah. All right. Comes in at just 70. No split lines here. And she's got a move special, the power behind the throne. Mind control, sidestep, stealth. When Loki uses mind control, after resolutions, hit characters are given an action token. Okay, so a little more control on top of the mind control. That's okay. not bad. Only an illusion is her defense power, which is energy shield deflection and super senses. She also has a damage special. I'm me. First, last, and always. Respect that. Okay. Probability control, shape change. So double rollouts and crazy mind control. When Loki uses shape change and succeeds, the attacker can't select a new target, and you may have them become the only target of the attack. Whoa! <laughs> Protected outwit. Oh. Okay. That's dirty. Dang, dude. That's, that's so like, dirty. That's like Scroll General on souped up, dude. Yeah, oh my oh gosh. Oh my gosh. Just make somebody punch themselves. Well, that's a big risk to punch. That actually is really scary. At 70 points, the double rollouts, precision oh. strike as well, some triple mind control. No improved targeting, but she does have improved movement characters. Uh, no move and attack either, but this is... Man. You get her in position. I mean, gosh, dude, do you ever want to attack this? Post no. her up next to a Ghost Rider Super Rare who says you can't <sighs> oh. get rid of she my like powers. Wave, so I get yeah. that shape change every time. Are there ways to boost shape change? Probably some way. Yeah. I think this is a really fun mechanic to Invest play in around. Battle Fury, Battle <laughs> Fury. Oh my gosh. This is... Uh, that's so good. That's really fun. <gasps> Uh, I know they did something similar with like the Hobgoblin and the Spider-Man set. Oh, yeah. Where it can kind of make you punch yourself. But this is, yeah, this is awesome. It's scary. And we better get her you properly get her on, the base. on her yeah. throne here, guys. All right. So that's a Super Rare a Prime. Uh, super Rare Prime. Or wait. Namor. Yeah, Namor. Namor Super Rare. White She's Tiger Super, super prime. prime. Here's our chase. Yep. So maybe another Super Rare left. Maybe Although Scott had a crazy brick, so... Who knows? Ooh. We have Amadeus Cho and Kirby. We have the Hashut Zaraz, Ramonda, Venom, and Ironheart. So I believe everything in this pack we've seen. Oh, this is kind of cool, though. Oh, yeah, We do yeah. get the 2023 World Champions, Antonio, Garrett, McConnell. Oh, and then the individual World mm. Champion. We have Pat Frazier. Pretty cool. Earth One Pat Frazier. Yeah, player yeah, yeah. Player. Oh, that is true. This is very much the <laughs> Earth One style Pat Frazier with the mm -hmm. longer beard, the longer hair. Yeah, I, I really dig this card. This one. Uh, That's so cool. Let's try to get this, you know, CGC, you know, 9.8 at least. <laughs> let's, you know, fingers crossed. PSA, but PSA. PSA 10. Going for PSA 10. I should have put gloves on before I touch this card, <laughs> honestly. Covered in oil. Uh, <laughs> covered in oil? Yeah. <laughs> what? Open, oily, a, open a booster. Open a booster. Haze. Open a booster. Covered, uh, covered in uh, oil. Goodness gracious. Maybe. I don't know what you do while What are I'm you gone. talking about? All right, let's see. Okay, uh, well, that ain't bad. We've seen it okay. before, but we'll talk about it again. Why not? Um, yeah, everything else we have seen in this booster. Dormilage, Misty Knight, Everett K. Ross, and Storm. And then, oops, should probably grab the cards here. We've got the Prime Tila. Oh, who cool. is, I think, like crazy solid. Again... Fantastic split lines on the dial and some prime worthy effects, but let's dive into her. All right, Tila comes in at 75 or 50, and she is Wakanda armor, assassin, spy, and warrior. She is, she's got a trait here that says specialized force. When a friendly character uses sidestep, they may move up to three squares instead. That's, okay. I think, crazy good yeah. with the amount of sidestep that you see on teams. 
I mean, a free action, you're getting 50% more value, and it's not keyword specific, it's just boom, here you go. Another trait, assassinating doom. Oh. Don't love that. <laughs> Don't love that. Free. Choose okay. an opposing character that healed since your last turn. Place Tila such that she may make a close attack targeting that character, then do so. That is really solid. Some retail that punishes your opponent for healing. Dig that. That is not bad at all. Just place her anywhere. And it's a free, so she gets to attack again afterwards. Pretty gnarly. She also has a damage special, Leadership, which there's no shortage of in, the, of in this set. Yeah. And so that's We Will Not Fail, Leadership. Other friendly characters with the Wakanda or Assassin keywords within range modify attack and defense plus one. She's got four range, so a nice bubble to bu uh, bump your stats. The improved movement is elevated outdoor blocking and characters. She's not a flyer, but if you play her at the 75 line, 8, 12, 19, 3, some monster stats. At 50, 8, 11, 18, 3, you lose the charge, you switch to sidestep of her own, which is 3, because it's not another friendly character, it's just a friendly character. So yeah, bumping up sidestep, I don't know how you can go wrong with that. That seems like crazy good to me. Hmm. So I dig it. Helps out the assassins too, which is a keyword I am growing more and more fond of with love each that. day. You love that keyword, man. I do. I'm a little crazy about it. <laughs> Should do, baby. <sighs> yeah, I give feel it to like me. yeah. Give I feel like me. you're definitely give more so a fan of this guy. Yes. <laughs> oh yeah, baby, Tony Hawk. <laughs> Tony Hawk. I can't believe they put Tony Hawk in the set, man. No, this is awesome. Ever since we saw this, he's gonna love our neighborhood. Very Tony oh, Hawkable. Very Tony the, Hawkable. The neighborhood, neighborhood over there. <laughs> Tony that is Hawkable. Such a stupid oh, inside that's joke. So dumb. <laughs> what a great wow. Basically, like if you see houses that are very, you know, the roofs are very curved, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you were playing a Tony Hawk game, it'd be very easy to grind on those. You know, you'd score a lot of points, right? So, if I was a real estate agent, my primary selling point would be how Tony Hawkable the neighborhood is. And Night Thrasher, we'd say, is a an excellent client. Okay, so we saw this guy at Gen Con. We saw a massive 90-point yeah. cost on this guy, which for Night Thrasher, yeah, a little wild. So I'm really excited to see what he does. Night Thrasher here, he's a super rare. Uh, team player, team ability. He's got new warriors, which another keyword that we've seen a little bit of in this set, yeah, too. Yeah, we have. Wakanda, armor, celebrity, martial artist, vehicle, and warrior. The skateboard, okay. I guess. I the skateboard dig that. being a vehicle. Heck yeah, man. <laughs> so vibranium funny. Vibranium skateboard for a trait. At the beginning of the game, add a vibranium token to your sidelines. Mm. This guy just gets one. Free, passenger one. Remove any one vibranium token from the sideline. If you do, move up to four squares. Okay, so just some free movement. That's not bad. He's also got customized transport. Charge, plasticity, and stealth as a move special. You'll see that all across his top dial. None on the lower line. He's got improved movement, elevated, and characters. And then the attack special, Eskrema sticks and flares. Energy explosion and quakes. So this guy's doing AoE damage from range and close. I dig that. Alternates between perplex and leadership. Okay, so that's nice. If you go with the top dial, you get perplex. And then on the lower line of 50, you get access to the Ooh. leadership. So again, more mm. good leadership like options that. for a ton of keywords. <laughs> Celebrity being a big one. <laughs> Martial artist, I think when everything's said and done, this is going to be a keyword to dive deep into. But 19 defense senses, perplexing it up to a 20. This guy's going to be skating around. He's going to be Tony Hawk in the neighborhood, baby. I really dig this. And the sculpt is also just, I mean, this is hilarious, right? <laughs> <laughs> this is a, a hilarious sculpt. I mean, yeah, he's like, what, is, what would he be? Just, I guess he's just jumping? Is it, is it popping a, a anything? Is this what a... trick is this? <laughs> what, 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 trick? what trick? What trick is he doing here? You gotta explain. I guess, yeah, that's like midair. So it could be, it could it could be, be anything. anything. It could be anything, yeah. Anything. Oh, that <laughs> rocks. That rocks. So funny. That, that's, I think that's my favorite. Oh thing my gosh. <laughs> Well, last pack. I can't imagine. He's there's like anything big more, too. Right? He is kind of big. All right, who do we got? Stu. We've got Black Panther, Luke Cage, Aim Agent, Killmonger, the rare, which we have seen, the one that makes the bystander very fun, mm. and then Misty Knight. It's another pack with nothing new, nothing you guys haven't seen. Yeah. But overall, wow, what a brick! Overall, yeah, this we've is, got uh, one, really cool. two super rares, a prime, super prime, a so, chase. Yeah. A super rare. Prime. A yeah, super there we go. So big hits, yeah. Very stacked, Across yeah. Scott's brick and this brick, yeah, the distribution seems fantastic. Really we good. saw some like double rare packs as well, which is very interesting. I like that 
kind of the regular distribution or coalition is being shaken up a bit. You know, with Notorious, we saw bricks with like four primes in them. That was kind of wild. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. This feels like we might be headed down a similar path. Maybe there's a God Pack out there. Maybe Ooh, there's... like quite literally a God Pack. Yeah, maybe. The chases are... That would actually be really sick. Oh, man. Oh, okay, man. yeah, that would rule. I don't know. I'm excited for Black Panther. We didn't get a set list. Mm -mm. Uh, nothing, you know, kind of unsure. I'm hoping, I guess, themes I would like to see explored more. If there is an Invader sub-theme, that would be really cool. I would like to see, like, a human... Oh, we got a Captain list. America. Oh, we did? Oh. Wow. <laughs> Sorry, what guys. A... <laughs> we'll end out on Dang. that. Dang, okay. okay. Well, uh, we'll throw that on screen for you guys, and we'll take a look. Let's take a look. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, sweet. Yeah, just kind of going down from... Because, yeah, these are all the chases, which are crazy cool. Njadaka. Zeus, we've seen. Loki, we just got. Chaos King, Odin and the Ravens, that's cool. Oh, Adam, man. Atum, Gaia, Bast, Hadera, Yao, and then the Phoenix Force, Black Panther. I feel like you butchered with, half of those. I probably, I probably <laughs> did. I don't, I don't know. Namor Shuri. Uh, okay, so this is, this is something I'm excited for. They mentioned Arnim Zola. He's going to be... Uh, looks to be like a super rare in the set. That's really sick. Falcon and Red Wing. That's really cool. Uh, and I do get my wish. I do get a super rare Captain America. That mm. rocks. I can't wait to see that. Okay. Yeah. Is anyone else jumping around for you? Because that's awesome to me. I'm I mean, the return of sight. Chaos King interests me a lot. That was a piece that is cool. I really enjoyed in Chaos. Eleven War. years ago, Chaos War twenty thirteen. Oh, yeah. yeah. Took him down to win the Infinity Gauntlet Thanos. Ooh. So have him return is cool. I just enjoyed that figure and. You know, seeing that he has a deity base, it seems like they're going to be doing him that is cool. pretty solid justice. On top of that, too, we see a War Machine rare, and then a Colonel James Road, or mm. yeah, Road, sorry, labeled as a B. And it has that little, like, star next to it, uh, which the Black Panther and the Tila does, so assuming a prime, prime. there. Which, uh, yeah, War Machine, anytime we get War Machine... I'm happy about that. He rocks. Yeah, I'm mean, just awesome. And he's been a prime a few times. He was a prime back in the old Iron Man set. Oh, yeah, he's that like was 250 the only other points. Yeah, just big beefy out. prime. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, do, do, let me see. I mean, we got Night Thrasher. I don't have anything else to ask. All right on. Cool. <laughs> I'm excited. Yeah, I can't wait to see what Captain America and Falcon and Red Wing do. That's going to be really cool. Falcon and Red Wing definitely, like, Hopefully an older style. Maybe it'll be new. I don't know. But that's like crazy cool. It's all about bystanders. There's a lot of bystander stuff in this set. So I'm really excited about that, guys. No, 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 no. What it's all about is you guys at home within the United States. Because you have a chance to walk away with everything that we just opened. That is true. So including the Night Thrasher yeah. even. Including the Cersei Legacy. Including the Primes, wow. the Chase. Everything. So, Calder, why don't you tell them how they can enter? Very simply, all you guys have to do is be subscribed to Dial H for Hero Clicks. You have to make sure you like this video and then comment on this video, and that is all. Then you'll be entered to win this entire brick. And we'll do a giveaway sometime here in the near future, and we'll get in contact with you just so that we know that you actually did win. But yeah, just like, comment, subscribe on this video, and you'll be entered to win. Guys, I'm excited for Black Panther. Pre-release is right around the corner. The, sh the set is shaping up to be a really good one. I can't wait to play some of it. But thank you so much for watching. Remember, for all your Heroclix content, unboxings, podcasts, videos, and more, make sure you dial H. And like always, happy trails.